pero seguir batallando, cuidado, y falta para los toques. ¡Sí! Loves me, she just wants to fuck me. Got me feeling something, got me feeling nothing. Alcoholic. Or multiply. Oh no. Seraphonics, it's just so good. Mm. Slaughter, it's just such a good slaughter game. Oh my god. Let me know overall the hero. At least he has a nice skin on it, so we are gonna see the pew pew gun on the sniper. But nice turn on to Kara instantly. With the right clicks coming through, they might just get this first blood. As Valky tries to mitigate it, Slade and we'll take the FB. Yeah, he's used the AKM, so. <clears throat> Arches. Chris coming in with a rotation on to the Alchemist. A few more right clicks to do to. the trick. But as in comes the Sprout, holding on to Valky. Along with the Spectral Dagger, he will go for the Slither and Crush and trying to shake it off. As Arges takes care of Smash up top. <laughs> Before that, he purchases a lot of sets because of the same. Oh, wait. Games. Rotation up top again from Chris. Oh. Onto Argus he goes, and Blackout goes down. Two. Oh. Smash with Stomping the Inkswell. The smash, yeah. Going in, nice. Hoof stomp onto the two as Blackout tries to heal himself back up with the one, but it's not going to be enough. As onto our just may they make a connection. Chris is just about to rotate in one more time. A stable concoction coming out from the Elk throws it out onto the Centaur, but a few more right clicks should do the trick. Chris wants to turn back around one more. It should oh. be enough. No, the one charge is again saving. I mean, when you're that influential as Thompson, it's not a surprise that people want to play like you, so. Why well, has been like three or four years ago? Oh, Christ! Another rotation up top, getting the Alchemist as M and Z. Half HP, but still absolutely fine on the lane. A 7 to 1 now. The Alchemist has just died for the third time, if I'm correct. Yeah. Three kills on the Alchemist. As MNZ finally falls, damn, I'm not catching these kills on time. Being checked on, can Chris come in from the other side? Stampede committed by Smash. He's just gonna make the connection. Silenced up. R just needs to try and shake it off before the unstable concoction tricks through. He's gonna manage, but Smash is in huge trouble. Nice hoof stomp onto two, He's but he needs right. to get out. Getting right clicked ain't super comfortable as Chris doesn't come in with the sprout to block it off. They're gonna call retreat. Love how C small plays this <clears throat> hero. Disengagement down onto the bottom. Shrapnel connection as with the shadow step as well. MNZ gets the kill in the end. But as they were ready for that rotation to come out on mid lane from Stereophonics, C smell. The ganking sniper on duty. Kara? Kara, looking to connect, does have Infernal Blade, will root down the Sniper, can Racer come in on time, as Chris comes on over with the Sprout, beautiful jump from Blackout, it's gonna lock in onto Sea Smell, as Stereophonics are actually doing it, they get Chris Luck, and can they get the, the Spectre as well, as the Silence Down Puck, can't do much, actually. On they go, Valky with a turnaround, on to MNZ, yes, the blade mail does a lot of work, but it should not be enough as it's a triple kill for the puck. Yeah, you're extremely happy if you're if you're the alchemist player. The last off play, Can you be happier? on to smash. Maybe with a kill? On with the unstable concoction, Camrage is also available, if I just need oh it. As the dive over, coming out from the shadow, with the shadow step, as Argus. Looking to connect, on to smash, Stereophonics, they're trying to shake off the enemy, but MNZ, the Sprout will miss, as Inkswell, play, coming out from the Grimstroke, the Unstable Concoction, blasts off onto the Elk, but they just cannot find Argus in the Chaos, as Invaders, they need a little more, Sea smell is looking to right click, but what is the question, as there goes the Stroke of Fate, a little more damage, should do the trick as on to Kara they make the connection. This time they do, and they are pretty even, so 50 50. Valky getting jumped on. He is gonna put out the Slytherin Crush, but gets who stomped himself. 13 to 8 now, and still Invaders leading 1k up against an Alchemist lineup. 
Crows of Haze, Valky's coming in. Blade Mail will be committed, trying to dish back some of the damage as the cavalry arrives from both sides. MNZ is in trouble as Kara looking to drop the Doom if he needs to, but will not need it. As Reyes jumping in on over, nice blast off play on to the Nature's Prophet. As all they need is the vision from the Crows of Haze to get that kill. They'll find the control. Oh, Valky surviving here is just not that great for the invader's side. Kara? This is a bait! As MNZ went on over just to get that kill, but with Chris, they can get more. As on to they go with Smash as well, the Stampede. Instead, no, actually, it was just a blink from Smash. Committed for the play. Pew, pew. And the pew that pew from Sea Smell will continue. That was the first tower of the game. Destined to. I mean, especially with uh, the sniper, it's not that hard. Heal. What the hell? The pressure is high, you might not be paying attention. Blackway? And they go with the stampede. Onto Valky they go. Straight up turn onto the Stardar. No more solo killing our Spectre. Says Invaders. Yeah, the huge message sent. Like, shocking is definitely on two heroes as well. <laughs> Smash. He's gonna find kill here, Kara. He was about to get his blink, so he's not that happy that he goes down. So I'll just right click the tier one tower down. In the end, nice deny from Racer. So with that DT rune. He wants again. Curse of the, the rotation, beautiful play coming out. Slade in. Gonna pop it with the ink swell. Take down the Slardar. As MNZ needs to back off because since he's corrosive haste. Chris looking for more. Wanting to be aggressive, well that could be bad, a smash. Gonna eat the dream coil. Because in the end, it's gonna be just a big disengagement from both sides. The blast off will miss from Blackout. They are not happy that they need to right click this centaur. Sled in! In with the catch, on with the soul bind, as it's a beautiful stomp coming out from Smash. He's just running interference, and Sea Smiles finally coming in with the right clicks. Doomed up is the sniper, but I think killing the alchemist first is what's most important. As Racer diving back, gonna get Smash, but can he move on to the sniper? No, he cannot. Another curse of the Earl's growth and the damage coming out from Sea Smile is just huge. As MNZ diving forward onto Kara to get this team wipe. Oh, they what assassinate a in the end. Gets the triple kill for the sniper. As uh, in comes the rotation, Valky and Racer. Locking on to Chris. That's a big kill. Valky, can they get more? Oh, no. Dream Coil will miss. And the was like, as well? That was like three pixels away from catching on him for in 10 seconds or more. Smash. And with the connection onto the puck. Silence down. They will just take down Razor to themselves. No need That's for me? the shadow step. As onto Valky. Now that might be worth it. Zemanzi coming on over with the stampede. On to the starter. They go and Slade and is just happy about this. As shadow step will be used to get Kara. Like seriously, what? It, it, look, look at, look at, look at it a bit more uh, from closer range. He's he's trying so bad. Get the doom <laughs> and the snap, Chris. They're Disperser. trying to save him. The disperser works out for he's him. Right he's just going to turn back onto Razor as Valky comes in for the catch. Nice blast off play. As in comes Smash and the others, but the damage from the Soul Bind and the Spectral Dagger is just too big. A Smash, he doesn't care. He's just going to double edge the puck as well. D, D, I mean A, D, or Razor. Uh, can they or eat this rush? This would be huge if, if it, they could manage it somehow. They're a bit too far in my eyes, but they're coming. Yeah, you're right. They might just want to fight into all of this. A sea smell picked up the game banner by mistake. They have the right idea about this. Chris? Smash moving forward. Totaro. Jumping on over onto Kara. As Chris is under danger, they do get the doom off. As the nature's wrath does its job, Valky. Silenced on the other side of the play as Smash is in the thick of it. He's still surviving as Seasmall finally arrives. Now all he needs to do is dish out the damage. 
The Alchemist all alone and surrounded. The Chemrage does nothing as it's a dominating kill streak now for the Spectre. Oh my god, they all got these speed items. Disperser, Lasso, Beat, everything. Four steps. No, so no Solar seeking. Crest, though, is the only no speed I ever have. No, just get more movement speed, boys. Just keep moving, boys. And the Sea Smell. Gonna get oh, nice jumped on. It's a beautiful play with the Dream Coil, but it only gets onto the back line as Racer. Losing HP and he's losing it fast. The Puck has no means of escape. Silence down, controlled. And it's another double kill for MNZ. Kotaro is just relentless here. It was actually Sladim with the quick reaction with the Phantoms and what he calls it. They're gonna call the GG as the second playoff team. Actually, the first playoff team to go down to the lower bracket here at Fast Invitational. Go to Pro Season 2, Invaders.